What's up everyone? So today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can turn a smooth dart like this into a groove dart like this for less than a tenner. So to start off with, what you're gonna need is a drill and you're gonna need a pack of these files. Now I got these off, off Amazon for about nine pound. They are ultra thin um, <coughs> diamond coated files. They are two mil wide. So, you're gonna need a drill and you're gonna need some of these. Now, what you're gonna to wanna to do, if you wanna go nearer the, where the shaft is, you're gonna to wanna to put, a, put a stem on the back, but if you wanna just put a line anywhere, then put the dart into the drill, tighten it up, and away you go. You put the um, file, I like to put the file, if you can see it on here, I like to put the file, if, if I'm gonna try and do a specific area, put the uh, dart up to the point that you want to file, or you want to groove, and then put the file in, like, in resting on the, uh, the dart and the drill, and you'll get a perfectly straight line, and it'd be easier to get your first groove cut in. Because the hardest thing to do is to get started. Once you're started, you can leave the file in the groove and it'll just get deeper and deeper until until you're done. But trying to actually get the groove started is quite difficult. So anyway, I'm gonna put the, the file on the dart and next to the drill and we're just gonna drill a, drill a groove into it. <laughs> Now you're gonna to have to bear in mind that metal rubbing metal is gonna get warm. So I normally have like a couple files out because when one gets too hot, you can't hold on to, just swap to another one. I've, I've done an entire dart and there's really no damage on the files. So the files are lasting really, really long. Um, so that's good. Uh, but yeah, keep swapping your files around so you don't get your fingers too hot because tungsten's hard metal. So if you've got a weaker metal, if, you're, you're, if you've got brass darts or maybe steel darts, uh, I feel like this would probably be a bit faster, but tungsten and darts are like super, super uh, tough. Okay, so just for effect to show you that you can do it, uh, that is what the dart looks like. Uh, you can put a groove in it. I've not gone as deep as I have on these ones. So these ones have got like some really, really deep grooves in them now. So they're extremely different to uh, how they looked at the beginning. I don't know if you can see that. I'll put some close-up pictures and videos and stuff in it as well. Okay, so let's say you have a dart like this, and you feel like it's got a knurl in the front, but you feel like the back of the grip isn't grippy enough. So you wanna deepen the grooves in this. Easy. So I like to put a small stem on, just so I can get close to the drill so it's not wobbling around too much. But we'll put the stem in. Get it nice and tight. And then, because the groove's already there, it shouldn't take too long, but let's try it. What's up? Um, camera just died, so I'm using my phone camera for a minute. But yeah, I don't know how much I said there, um, but this is what the darts look like now. I don't know if you can see them or not. Um, there is a lot more grip on the dart that I've just done. You can really, really feel it. 
uh, compared to the to, to the previous one. Um, and then, so that only took about five minutes to do that dart. If you want to do your own darts where you take a smooth dart and you put grooves in it, it is going to take you a little bit longer. Um, that probably took me like half an hour to do that entire dart. Um, but these things, nine pounds ish, uh, really cheap. The drill, if you haven't got one, you can borrow one of someone. If someone you know has got a drill, there's 100% someone you know has got a drill. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed the video, like it, please, and subscribe if you're brand new. Um, let me know in the comment section below what you'd like to see me do next, if there's any weird, quirky things that you like. Uh, I've got some good videos coming up in the next few days and they're just, just for uploaded and stuff. Some different dart stuff, not the usual crap that you see on YouTube day in, day out. We're doing some different stuff on this channel. But guys, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, yeah, good luck with uh, with altering your darts yourself instead of having to send them away to someone else. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next one. Goodbye.